Sydney Sweeney recently opened up about the shocking backstory behind her emotional breakdown on Instagram Live that left her in tears. Let's get into it. Euphoria star Sydney Sweeney is getting real about the haters and recently opened up about the very real impact cyberbullying can have on other people's lives. As you may recall, Sydney started trending back in May 2021 after she appeared in a tearful Instagram Live in response to a viral tweet making the rounds on the internet with, I can't even believe I'm saying this out loud, let alone people making a trend, calling her ugly and mocking the way she looks. Um, hello, are we talking about the same person here? Have those people actually seen how gorgeous Sydney is? Irrespective of the fact that nobody should ever mock the way someone else looks, whether they have superstar looks or not. Okay, moving on. During her Instagram Live, Sydney broke down as she opened up about how the trolling had affected her, saying she thought it was really important for people to see how words actually affect people with tears streaming down her face. Sydney shared, And I know everyone says you can't read things and you shouldn't read things, but I'm a f person. She went on to add, People need to be nicer on social media because it's really f up. Ugh, this honestly still is so heartbreaking. And while speaking with Cosmopolitan for their February cover story, Sydney revealed that there's so much more that went on behind the scenes leading to her emotional breakdown on Instagram Live. In what can only be described as a seriously bad day, Sydney explained that the morning prior she was scheduled to shoot a campaign with a lingerie brand, but had just started her period and didn't want to appear bloated in the pics. After a quick Google search, Sydney found three or four pills of birth control and mix it with Advil or Tylenol and it'll make you stop your period, which she then proceeded to do. And yeah, to be honest, that doesn't exactly sound like a great or healthy idea. Sydney then started feeling dizzy and nauseous after arriving for her shoot and admitted to feeling super embarrassed after she threw up in the middle of the shoot. Poor Sydney. Sydney explained, I was a mess. I felt so embarrassed. I was jacked on so many different hormones and continued, I was appalled at myself because I'm always so on top of it and professional. Yeah, this is definitely not a fun position to be in. And Sydney's bad day was made even worse after she fell out with a friend over text messages. Sydney revealed to the magazine, So that happens and I'm already crying, throwing up. And then two seconds later, I go on Twitter and see that I'm trending. I'm reading all these comments saying so much stupid stuff about my appearance. I went on social media and cried. She went on to add, People were like, oh, she's just looking for attention. People literally kill themselves over stuff like this. Before adding, I went on for like maybe 12 seconds. I did not think anyone was going to record it. I just needed to let it out. Then it just went everywhere and became its own beast. Sydney then explained that she hadn't thought people would actually record her Instagram live and months after the whole incident went down, revealed that she's still feeling a little embarrassed about the situation. She said, It's something people deal with on a daily basis. Am I embarrassed? Of course. I still don't think everyone is going to see what I do. We're sorry to hear that Sydney still feels embarrassed, but we are so here for Sydney speaking her truth. Because seriously, bullying someone on the internet isn't any less harmful than doing it in person. For now, we just can't wait to see Sydney finish out the rest of Euphoria Season 2. And we are so curious to see what will go down with Cassie, Maddie and Nate ahead of the finale. We're honestly so proud of Sydney for continuing to keep it real and seriously hope that from now on, the trolls can just mind their business and stay off the internet. For all things Euphoria Season 3, including fan predictions of what will happen in the Season 2 finale, click right over here for the full rundown. After that, let me know your thoughts on everything Sydney shared about her emotional Instagram Live in the comments section below. I'm your girl Susan Morad, you can find me on socials at Susan underscore Morad. I'll catch you later.